Well, Sam, uh, another strong performance from your side, but it's one goal that wins it. Everton get it. Do you feel as though your side did enough to take a point home tonight? Should have taken three, really. I think that um, uh, there's two two situations. One, um, we we could have scored a goal in the first minute, and um, and then should have had a penalty. Uh, if we convert the penalty, we get one nil up. Convinced on the way we played tonight that 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 would have meant that we didn't lose this game and then come away with at least a point. Even in saying that, after Everton scored, um, we scored a great goal. And unfortunately, because of the situation with VAR, it's two millimetres. So we had a big, half a big toe offside, I believe. So that's very difficult to take where, you know, just just another just another couple of millimetres or a centimetre behind the ball. We're, we're coming in with 1-1. One, one. We're delighted with the performance, delighted with the point, uh, and possibly deserve to maybe have got three again tonight. Um, but unfortunately, none is uh, not what we're looking for. So... Uh, we can take art about the performance, we can look at the lads and say well done, but at the end of the day, it's about points for us, not about well done and a good performance. So that might sound nice, but it's the fact of the matter. And we've uh, let another game go by, and now we're farther away from fourth and bottom than we were before we started and played one game less. It was a game of chances, wasn't it? And Bice had a couple, and Calvert Lewin's missed one. Charles has missed one, but then he's stuck one in at the other end. So it's, it was fine margins tonight that decided it. It was, but I mean, I think that, um, I mean, you look at Calvert Lewin's chance, if we got that amount of luck by just getting the ball deflected right in front of your feet, like, would we have put it in the back of the net? Like, I mean, I have to say, Sam pulled off a brilliant save, and, uh, and, and, and it would have been a real cruel blow for us from, to score that goal after we kept Everton so quiet tonight. So. You know, that defensive solidarity is looking better and better, um, uh, but unfortunately, um, we haven't got a clean sheet again. So, um, so both ends, I can't really criticise the players for what they've done today. I think they've given everything they possibly could give, um, and a bit more, and just perhaps our final quality at the, at the top end and the slightly offside decision as uh, as cost us dear just finally sam how important is it now to to stay upbeat heading into sunday's game against newcastle and also how important is recovering in the next couple of days well we're at a disadvantage when we start the game on on sunday because uh, because we have to kick off at 12 o'clock so our rest period is is not that uh, not that great i've seen a uh, uh, what everybody says or might say, there's definitely a dip in your physical presence or your physical output if you've had a game in midweek when you play the next game a few days later. So we'll have to make up for the physical side of the game by the technical side being better uh, and being able to cope with what Newcastle have and trying to break that down. So we physically won't be as good as we were tonight because that's impossible. So what everybody says or what anybody thinks, Oh, well, you know, your professional footballers get paid a lot of money. It's a fact of the matter um, because recovery time means that you have to recover well enough to give what you give tonight. So um, we will go out and use our, our heads, use tactically be very good. Um, I'd say to the players, give everything you've got. And if you haven't got any more, we'll make, a sub we'll make three substitutions as the game goes on because I don't need them to, to hold back. I need them to go right from the start. And if they, if they end up tiring, we'll, we'll substitute them and, and try and win this game that's coming up against Newcastle.